Hey, what's up guys? What's, what's good? How's everyone doing? Did you know that you don't need to draw your scales in FL Studio? You can actually just select them and have them on your screen right in front of you. And this will basically save you trying to draw your scales manually like this. Like this is the E chord and you can see all the white keys on the E. And you would just kind of, you know, you wouldn't know that in FL Studio. But you would kind of just draw them up yourself. And then you would scale them and you would move them like one scale down and up. And you would do that throughout you know when you want to start off on the scale now you can do that really really quick just by going on up here uh, into the drop down selecting helpers on your piano scale and scale highlighting and then select the notes now usually you'd have this set on default right so there's nothing selected um, if you go up here select helpers scale highlighting it would actually show you black notes first just like that okay and that's how we used to see in FL Studio oh but just going in here clicking on help us scale highlighting selecting major first we don't see major chord selected yet because we still haven't selected the right note if we go back into help us scale highlighting and now we can see that the major we've got all this scale on the side we're gonna select the root note being E as soon as I selected E, we can now see all the white nodes as E and we don't actually need to go and draw it in there because if we zoom in, you can see that all the E keys are selected white so now when we make our beat and pretend this is the kick, this is the melody you could build your melody just simply by using the white keys does that make sense? so you can go in there and if you want to change the scale you can change it really quickly just by going into the scale uh, let's say you wanted to go from my, ma major to minor pantronomic you can go to minor pantronomic then help us scale highlighting so minor pantronomic and G sharp and there we go we got the full G sharp minor scale pantronomic selected and we can just start using the keys and the scale that we have so I hope I taught you something there guys something really quickly for you uh, if you haven't already make sure you subscribe check us out on producersbuzz.com got a lot more tutorials in FL Studio coming up soon loads of tips and loads of great drum tutorials take care, peace out and stay safe